lovers watching, YouTube subscribers. My name is Tori. And Rayleigh, would you like to introduce yourself? This is Rayleigh, my eight and a half week old Italian Greyhound. All right, Rayleigh, let's tell everybody why we're making this video. Um, so, so basically, as you can see, um, my dog, well, should not say my dog, this point is to um, talk to people who want an Italian Greyhound. <laughs> Quit. Um, if you want a dog that is super playful and has very sharp teeth, this is the one for you. Nah, scratch that. But on the real side, if you want a dog <laughs> that wants to cuddle and sleep with you <laughs> and love you, uh, I want to say 24-7, but... Um, Definitely, maybe like 18.7. This is the dog for you. <laughs> um, basically, my experience with her so far, it, it's been really good. Luckily, I've been able to be home. Um, just having some time off from work and whatnot. So, I was able to prepare an entire room for her as I will show my friends and family the big room that we prepared. So, puppy pads, number one, something you will definitely need, even though she has yet to use them. Um, I just got a little container, so this is what I put her in on the way home with some blankets in and everything. Um, you definitely want something to put your Italian Greyhound in or any puppy when you go to pick them up because they are totally scared in the car. Most likely will be their first time in the car. Um, a few other tips that I would love to share are baby blankets. Baby blankets are key because your puppy is going to potty everywhere. <laughs> if it's not on the rug, not on the pee pad, in the bed, it will be on one of her baby blankets. I purchased a pack of 10, I think it was, nine or 10, I don't know, but there's a lot. I still have some folded that I have not used yet. Um, she loves them. I think I paid $7 for them. Totally worth it. Um, something else, I mean, I could go over some useful tips for for sure stuff that I was prepared with stuff that I wasn't prepared for um, I bought this crate it's it's foldable as obviously it's folded but it's a pretty cool pin <laughs> play pin <laughs> that um, you can either use for overnights if you don't believe necessarily in the metal crates or kennels, um, I know some people that refuse to put their puppy in a in a crate, a metal crate. Um, <laughs> I have both because I just am that prepared. So I put her in the metal <laughs> crate <laughs> at night, and my experience with that at night so far um it's it's been it, it's been a journey don't chew on that <laughs> and um one thing i do suggest because the dog is so small you can easily just put your metal crate like on a table next to where you sleep so she goes on my side of the bed on my bedside table um you know she does cry for sure but the first night I think I woke up to her crying maybe three times and I just put my hand in there she could smell them right there and she fell right back to sleep so but of course don't expect to sleep in till 9 10 o'clock in the morning anymore because she's gonna have you up probably around 7 and then immediately needs to go outside because the whole point of potty training I am just as new to this as 
anybody. So I'm willing to take more tips and advice from people if you have any um, with potty training. I've just been doing my best trying to take her outside as much as I can. Um, she has gone outside a total four times, so success for Rayleigh. Right, baby? Um, so anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. I definitely would recommend a snuggle puppy. My success with that has been really good. Um, it's helped her sleep, I feel, throughout the night. It has um, like a little heartbeat thing that you slip in the belly of it and then you put a heater in there as well so when you order the snuggle puppy it comes with the heartbeat and the heater quit um so for crying dogs at night it definitely helps i think you know it just reminds them of having their mom or something so um <laughs> but yeah <laughs> just about the overall image of an Italian Greyhound if you want one. Seriously, they're nothing but what the internet will tell you. Super, super affectionate. Like, she just constantly wants to be held at all times, and I love that. And if you want a dog that can play and run and enjoy water, outdoors, uh, adventures, all that stuff, Italian Greyhound's the way to go. She has literally gone everywhere with me. Home Depot, TJ Maxx, Publix, like Walmart, the whole nine. I got her certified. That was one of the first things I did just so I could bring her everywhere. Um, but yeah, so I am pretty excited. This is my first video. I'm going to try and keep up with the whole experience with Rayleigh considering I'm gonna have about a couple weeks off from work, so. Join us next time for our next video. She's eating. Say bye, Bailey.